confining elements, walls and tie elements. To confine the construction, the masonry uses the reinforced concrete as a chain rolled up continuously around all sides of the walls. This prevents the walls from falling apart during an earthquake. The vertical reinforced concrete ties are called tie columns, and the horizontal ones are called plinth for below and ring beam for above. These are not to be confounded with columns and beams from the reinforced concrete frame construction. To ensure a strong anchoring, confined masonry joins the masonry with the horizontal ties and the toothing ensures the fastening of the walls to the tie columns. The tie columns are in turn anchored deep in the foundation and the resulting system functions as a strong and continuous chain. The following example should help to better understand how the tie elements work. These four boards represent the four walls of a building. If, for example, the ring beam alone is added to the top of the walls, the construction remains fragile and will fall apart easily. The same happens if only the tie columns are made. However, if we combine all the tie elements required to confine the walls, the resulting construction becomes a rigid and more resistant one. Shear walls. A shear wall is a solid wall panel whose function is to brace the building. Shear walls should have no openings. If they do, the openings should be of a small size and located away from the wall panel diagonals. In a building, the shear wall should be placed as follows, in both directions of the construction, as much as possible on the outer walls, evenly distributed on the building layout, on each floor, and placed respecting vertical continuity. Seismic bands and opening reinforcements. Two other reinforced concrete elements must be built to ensure a resistant construction. The seismic bands and the opening reinforcements. The seismic bands are horizontal confining bands which must be built every meter 20 high. The opening reinforcements are additional vertical bands placed on either side of all openings, such as doors and windows.